If I could be British, I would. She be mine, mine on me. She did on me. She be mine, mine 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 on me. Hey guys, it's Ali. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another vlog. I don't know if you can tell, but by the sound of my voice, I have been feeling a bit under the weather as of late. Even more than under the weather, I was sick. I don't even know if I can say the word sick in a YouTube video without it. I don't know, like catching something in the algorithm, but I have been um, feeling a bit under the weather for the past week. October the 4th day, whenever it is, I got back from home. I got a sore throat. It started off as a sore throat, and I always know when I get a really bad sore throat, I'm about to get sick or about it's gonna get worse basically. So I got a sore throat, started coughing, stuffy nose came, then headache came, couldn't really get out of bed. I took a, a C test that same day. Um, I got back because I was like not playing with this sore throat and I've been like in and out of the airport since I've been going to see Michael I went back home for a wedding. It wasn't the virus going around so that was in the clear So I think I just had a, well have a really bad cold or flu And it's been a week and I was supposed to like clean my apartment Film a vlog for you guys all this stuff So I'm like let me try and pull it together on this fine Sunday night and try and give you guys an at home vlog and kind of get things done since I'm feeling a smidge better. I still have a really, really bad headache and I've been trying to drink more water as Michael has told me online says to drink more fluid. So that's what I'm trying to do. So this is not gonna be a super long at home vlog because I am sick. I can only do so much. And I really just want to crawl back into bed, but I'm making this video for you guys and I can't leave my YouTube channel hanging for long. No one can really leave their YouTube channel hanging for long because if you go away for a while, when you come back, no one might be there. Other than that, things have been going okay. I've kind of been doing a little bit of a British accent up and down around the house just talking to myself because I have been watching the challenge so much if you follow me on Instagram you know that I love this show I don't even know why I started it I started on season 21 and I've just been hooked and literally I am finished season 34 on Saturday literally if you follow me on Instagram you already know I blow through um, seasons and binge watch them so fast because I work from home while I'm editing I watch them basically like all day I just have it playing like whether I'm in bed or if I'm doing stuff season 33 and season 34 had quite a bit of a large UK cast if I must say so I've just been doing the accent and if you know me I'm a UK baby at heart so I love the UK accent I love the British accent you know if I could be British I would but one thing that I did want to share with you guys, I told you guys that I wanted to get a new iPad and I did indeed do so. Finally, I've been saying that I wanted an iPad for forever. You know why I feel like I'm stuck in life? It's because I ain't got an iPad. Like, no, I cracked the code. That's the reason. Having an iPad would make me a more focused person. Like, I can do planning on here. I'm going to have, like, my calendar on here. I am going to be getting a Mac desktop as well. So I went ahead and got the new um, iPad Air. This is the one that comes in the colors. And I'm just going to go ahead and put in a little bit of a montage for you guys of me unboxing my new iPad and my Apple Pencil. <music> That was pretty cute. So like I was saying, I got the new iPad Air in the color rose gold. I was in between this one and the sky blue and the green. The pastel green was really cute, but the thing with the sky blue, it kind of looked like just gray. So I'm like, I might as well go ahead and do something that looks different. But it's super cute. Um, I really like the fact that the pencil just sticks to it like that. And this is actually how you charge the pencil. So once you place it here, the pencil is charging. So it's just really pretty so far. I still have to get a case for it and then like download some apps for planning and then share that with you guys like in a future vlog. So far, I just have the apps for my phone and I've downloaded 
this new game called taboo it's kind of like episode so the story that i'm playing right now is the bodyguard story and i named my character annabelle she's cute or whatever i don't have a lot of money or like gems because i refuse to buy them so i went ahead and asked my boyfriend for five dollars so i can buy some gems so now i'm about to buy this girl some new clothes because girl on this game all the ugly clothes are free and i'm like y'all want me to seduce this man wearing this what i did want to try out on my ipad though was editing photos just to see how it goes i am gonna make another youtube video on like how i edit my instagram photos because you guys asked but i really don't do a crazy amount to my instagram photos just a few touch-ups here and there but the main apps that i do use are face app and facetune i'm not gonna really do it on camera because it doesn't take me a long time to edit my photos but i usually like to do it while i'm watching something so i'd rather get more things done than just editing photos because i can do that while i'm in bed so one thing that i do really need to do is build this new desk that i got because like i said i am getting my mac desktop before i go ahead and build my new desk my last few vlogs haven't been sponsored so i'm super excited to say that this video is sponsored by jbw watches so they are a luxurious watch brand and they specialize in diamond timepieces i've been working with them for almost two years now so for almost two years this has been the only watch brand that i have worn on my wrist every single time you see me wearing a watch it is 100 percent jbw watches i literally love them so much i think i have at least six of their watches all of them are so bomb so i have one right now the crystal 28 this watch features 12 real diamonds along with 1095 swarovski crystals this watch is super icy this watch is so sleek i love the square face of the watch coupled with the diamonds going all the way around the wristband of the watch i feel like it just makes it look so elegant so expensive literally you're iced out every which way you turn your wrist and i get so many compliments on this watch when i wear it i am currently wearing mine dressed down but i especially love this watch for my going out looks i love wearing this watch to date night dinners when i go out with my friends and i'm gonna put some pictures up on the screen and a few videos of what it looks like when i wear it out and i'm all dressed up the crystal 28 is literally my favorite accessory of all time to pair with my outfits everybody looks good at this watch like i've been seeing so many people catch on to jbw and whenever girls wear their watches out you guys look so good in them this watch is definitely a timepiece to match her shine it's just so effortless while being extra at the same time if you guys are interested in shopping jbw you just make sure to tell them i sent you by using my discount code angui jbw to save you some money as well if you guys have any questions about J my jbw watch just make sure to comment down below and i'll get back to you but and thank you so much to jbw watches for sponsoring this video okay so now i'm gonna go ahead and try and build my desk i'm gonna bring it into my living room right now i'm in the kitchen and it's at my front door loki i think i'm gonna get another water bottle and um keep it next to me just so i can stay hydrated because i really have like a massive headache for some reason and i cannot bend down and like stand up too quickly or like it hurts super bad like, i don't know what's happening with that so i'm just gonna try and get done with my tasks for the day and like the little stuff i want to show you guys in this vlog so i can shower and sleep yeah let's go ahead and get it because it's kind of really heavy <laughs> oh my goodness i swear i cannot wait until i live with my boyfriend because michael when he's here he helps me out so much like he helps me lift heavy stuff he would literally build this for me and i will be in my room or i'll be cooking for us like this this kind of stuff is not meant for me like the box is literally <laughs> this box is literally the freaking size of me <sighs> I'm just gonna put on the screen what the desk is supposed to look like and hopefully I build it like this I have my handy dandy pink box cutter from Amazon and I also have my toolkit that I had bought from Ikea back in Ohio I wish I had a power drill but I don't I never bought one so hopefully I can do this in under an hour so definitely you're gonna be watching some TV while I do this because why would I sit here in silence also on Paramount Plus there's Survivor which I have never watched but I've heard of the show so much and I feel like they might complete challenges too. I don't really really know what Survivor is about, but I know they are like on an island. Reality TV is low-key, kind of like a vibe. It's kind of like a slight vibe. So I'm going to go ahead and start. And right now it is 11.22 p.m. And I wanted to be in bed by 12, but that's definitely not happening. But all right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and start. So let's roll the footage. <laughs>
I have literally, for the past 20 minutes, been trying to put this screw in this piece. Like, I'm actually doing a pretty decent job. And I'm like, why didn't they give me longer screws? Meanwhile, this definitely tells you don't use the small screw, use this screw. But I'm like, okay, I'm not going to be stupid. There's two different size screws. There's okay, so you see there's this little baby screw. And there's these screws. These are definitely longer. Meanwhile, there's four more longer screws over here. I just wasted so much time and I'm so freaking dizzy. Anyways, let me keep going. I feel like I'm really getting the hang of this. So anyways, back to the video. If I would have lined up the screws I needed and made sure because that one little mishap that I showed you guys in the video so I wasted a bit of time there and um, I haven't really been feeling well the whole time I was building it like my head hurts so bad and I was feeling so dizzy but I'm like I need to finish this I already started it I absolutely could not be happier there's a squeak and I think there might be a little bit of like plastic wrap on something like that but i'm just happy that the drawers go in and out smoothly and close really well like i did not mess up let me not jinx it i did not mess up on that part it just looks so sleek hopefully i'll be able to do a furnished apartment tour if it looks the way that i want it to but i'll link this desk down below for you guys a couple of different websites sell these this desk it shipped really fast like i think it came in two days and it said it was going to take like four or five days um i think the glossy top makes it look more expensive i think it cost me like 150 or whatever but that, i think that's a decent price for a desk that should last a long time and i just wanted to make sure that i built this really well because my mac desktop if i can sit on it then i should be fine so i'm sitting on it right now um, which means it should be fine. But now I just gotta get an office chair. And right now I'm really hungry. I look a freaking mess. So happy this is built. I feel really accomplished just doing that. Um, I really do want to go to sleep, but I cannot just close out the vlog here. And I don't even think I'll have the strength to vlog tomorrow. But I really need to make this TikTok salmon rice and eat anyways. So let's go ahead and do that. <laughs> Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another episode of Cooking with Angui. For today's meal, we're gonna be making the famous TikTok salmon rice. I have all my ingredients right here. You're gonna need soy sauce, some sriracha sauce. I'm using some original sriracha. Then I have some Nando's Piranes tangy and fiery hot mayo. And I'm using this as a substitute for Kewpie mayo because that's what you they used on TikTok, but I could not find that at Publix. And this was like next to the sushi, so I'm like, it still should work. And you're gonna need some rice, which I have right here, and some cooked salmon, and like seaweed strips. I also got this at Publix. All right, so we're starting out with the plate. Um, the other two times that I had this, I did it in a bowl, but that's fine. What I'm gonna do is put the rice on my plate. It looks really ugly right now, but that's fine. We'll take a wet paper towel and put this over the rice. Some people in TikTok videos use ice, but it literally looked like the ice did nothing. 
and I think Michael taught me this trick and I'm gonna warm this up for like a minute. Our rice came out really, really lovely. It's nice and soft now. I'm not gonna do this the exact same way as the TikTok did. I'm not sure which goes first, but literally all these things are gonna go together. So I'm gonna pour the soy sauce on my rice first. I feel like that's where it needs the flavor because my salmon is already flavorful. And then I'm gonna take the salmon, which I just warmed up for like 30 seconds, and then you're gonna smash it whoa be careful if you're not using fresh salmon because mine's like really hot from the microwave warmed it up a little bit now that both ingredients are together i'm gonna take my spicy mayo and you're just gonna drizzle that on there you want to put like a generous amount of these things like it's actually so yummy and then i'm gonna take my sriracha and believe it or not i've never had really eaten sriracha before this take your fork and you're gonna mix it all together some people also add avocados like once you're done mixing everything together and this is why i prefer a bowl because it's just easier to mix the rice but i don't have any clean bowls right now this is basically what your completed rice is gonna look like i know it kind of looks messy but it's fine your last and final step is to just get your seaweed and eat so this is what the seaweed looks like when you take it out it looks really really nice i was gonna say that this is a dish that i suggest that you use chopsticks for you really do need them to be honest and all you're gonna do is take a seaweed strip place it on top of your rice it's kind of tricky because my seaweed is crunchy and you basically just fold it on top of it like so and you just take a bite mm. literally so freaking yummy i don't know what i was expecting the first time i tried it but it tastes like sushi like you're having a sushi roll and i, I feel like that's mostly because of this seaweed wrap but it tastes really really good and along the way you can add as much or as little mayo as you want the first time i was eating it i was adding more mayo because i really like the taste of it so yummy basically if you like sushi you're gonna like this and i'm not talking about like raw sushi i mean like shrimp tempura roll sunday morning roll that those kind of rolls that are not raw yeah it's just crazy how all of these flavors really work well together but i really recommend you guys try this it's not a crazy expensive meal and i'm gonna eat this and then drink some water but while i drink my water i think i'm gonna put some liquid iv in it i've been using the passion fruit flavor and it's kind of rubbing me the wrong way it feels like i'm drinking pedialyte like when i was younger i'm gonna try lemon lime today and i really love liquid iv a lot i found this on when i was on instagram almost maybe like six months ago kayla nicole put it on her story and you could get free samples and then lo and behold two months ago i saw it on tiktok as a way to quickly get over a hangover and it really does work because one of these packets inside a water bottle is three water bottles so it's like the hydration you drink one is the hydration of actually like two to three water bottles which is such a great thing if you can't drink a lot of fluids or if you're like me you don't eat enough or you don't drink enough water definitely the way to go it's kind of a little bit expensive i think i think it's like 20 dollars for each or something like that maybe it's cheaper on their website but i got mine um from target but basically if you're using this to cure for a hangover you're supposed to either drink it the night before, but I remember I came home from a night of drinking and I just was like, let me just put this in a bottle. And I think I only drank half of it. When I say I woke up and I did not have a headache, I was so surprised because you know, like you usually get a hangover because alcohol dries out your brain. Right now, um, it's like almost 4 a.m. guys. Me and my boyfriend ended up talking on the phone and like I said, I finished that at 2.30. So this is like a really late, Sunday vlog, but the lemon lime flavor is better. Kind of still tastes the same on ice, but I'm just gonna eat this meal real quick and then we're gonna get back to the rest of the vlog. I don't know how the lighting is in here, but basically I just want to open some PR that I've gotten recently. I was at the mall two weeks ago and I got a few items from Forever 21 and I never shop there anymore. It's all activewear, by the way. I picked out 
this activewear sports bra yeah i just thought i don't have anything with like a zipper in the front so i just thought i'd pick this out and it's really cute and it's a seamless material as well three pairs of their seamless leggings they had this on display and i was walking by and i was like forever 21 has seamless leggings and these look like a really good quality seamless leggings like they're super stretchy which is really good this is $14.99 $15 for a good pair of seamless leggings is actually a steal i got a black pair because you can never have enough black pair leggings because you can always get away with the, wearing these like so many times $12.99 for a pair of their active wear shorts and these are high rise and they look really cute last my last vlog i told you guys that i bought vapor maxes and so bad i wore them on a flight and they just killed my toes and my feet so i upped a size i upped a half size and got size seven my normal shoe size is a six and a half so if you get these shoes you might need to go up a half size yeah let's save the best for last so i get like boxy charms monthly and i just like post them on my story they come as pr and if you're not familiar with boxy charm they're just like a monthly makeup and beauty subscription that you can get and it's like a box that comes every month but you don't know what's in it and there's five full-size products so this is the october box it has like candy on it for like spooky season and then the back of the card also tells you like what's in it the first thing in here is from trust loose beauty it looks like a four piece makeup brush set literally like opening your boxy charm is like christmas because you don't know what's in it the brushes are like a medium softness like like not like crazy soft just like regular this deep royal blue but they're also matte these are so cute i definitely need more eye brushes and blending brushes so a pair of lashes these are super natural and adhesive liner so you just put this on your eye and then stick the lashes on very on brand for the season because you know it's fall right now and they wanted to be kind of on brand for october so you can create your like halloween looks and your october and your fall looks with this i'm definitely gonna try this out loving the packaging fresh show shock for your under eye so it's basically under eye cream but that is what came in my october boxy charm last month september they actually ended up sending me like the deluxe version which vitamin e and retinol serum and i cannot wait to start using this this is by clara's new york booty drops firming body oil this is by Frank Body. Three to four drops into your moisturizer or use directly on dry skin. Rub all over your body. Use daily. Love body oils. This would be like a nice thing to travel with. Like so this is the lash set. It comes with a pair of lashes that are way more dramatic than the last pair. This actually looks like a pair of lashes that I would wear. It comes with the applicator. This is by Laura Seller. These are the colors in this palette hydrating face mist whenever you need it like my skin is pretty dry right now so i'm gonna probably try this out in the morning it says hydration happy so that was it for the boxy charm both of my boxy charms thanks to, to boxy charm for sending those to me and now we're gonna open my gift from pretty little thing this came in the mail like as a surprise from plt i don't know if this was supposed to be a 12 days of christmas but it's october so I don't think that's it. Yeah, so let's go ahead and open all of these and see what gifts I got from PLT. Everything's pretty light, so it's probably just like makeup products. So this is Black Magic Liquid Liner. You know we love liquid liner. I love doing my like beauty marks. This is so nice. This might be a UK brand because it says Manchester United Kingdom on there. You know me, Boss Babe wearing eyeliner from London. Small things, you know? These boxes are so cute. It's so sad that I have to throw them away repairing oil for all hair types um this is from the band i think 72 i love the clean aesthetic of this everything is like so nicely wrapped with like gold foil tanning stuff i think this is tan i cannot um i already have melanin a lot of it so i cannot tan so i probably will gift this to somebody who tans definitely looks right up my eyeliner for lip liner it's like a dark chocolate brown and we love that for us coconut oil conditioning shampoo oh my gosh i wish this was lotion it has vitamin e i needed a clear lip gloss anyway this is wet cherry gloss by lime crime i actually am familiar with the lime crime brand i have never heard of this brand before number eight this is a wet and wild lipstick the packaging is so freaking cute i hope that i can use this i don't know how to describe this like a dark mojave color that's so cute i don't know if anybody watched totally spies i'm not even gonna say that a lot of us watched totally spies because that was a mother freaking vibe back in the day this looks like um one of their cute little gadgets this is so cute 
definitely gonna have to start like a face mask bucket. Chronic London, I love this makeup brand so much. Um, I used to be on their PR list, but I haven't updated my new address with them. I need to because I literally love their, their makeup products and their packaging. It's always like sleek and gold. Is this their regular sponge? I have no idea, but you can never have too many beauty sponges and I always keep mine for too long at a time. Oh! We have a NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Madeline and if you have been following me, this is like one of the best nude glosses for brown and dark skin tones. Like trying to do a nude lip, this is the go-to. So this is Madeline and I'm glad they just gave me another one. I, I'm from NYX like, I don't know, like six, eight months ago or something like that. But absolutely love Madeline and pairing it with like a little like lighter pink one. But this is like the absolute like boss babe shade of nude for my brown skin and dark skin girls. I'm so happy they included this in here. I think that's all the packages that I have to open. Um, one of these days I might do an Amazon haul or showcase it in a vlog. But I've bought quite a few things from Amazon and I have not really opened the boxes because I just get so busy and my couch and all that other stuff isn't here for me to put it away. Whoa, it's 5 a.m. I'm gonna sleep in so late tomorrow, but I'm just so glad that I was able to like do all of this. I feel like it might not seem like that much, but after being sick, building this desk alone, like I just need like 10 pats on the back for that. But I'm gonna go ahead and get ready for bed. And then... Yeah, but I feel like that was a pretty productive day day if you will call it i started this vlog at like 10 p.m but i'm actually really glad i did because now i don't really have to work tomorrow i think i might be able to turn this content in on time instead of the, the extension i asked for because i've been sick loki not loki Heike, i might be thinking about getting off birth control because i get really bad um pms symptoms like the week before my cycle starts pms week like i cry all the time or nothing like something can just upset me and like it's actually kind of like torturous to my boyfriend like this tiktok right here guess who's on her period <laughs> this, this is actually me like this is legit me like i'm actually like a demon on my cycle <laughs> But yeah, I had wrote stuff down for this vlog because like my brain is all over the place. Saying I have so many things that I still need to order for my entire apartment and my beauty room slash den room. Um, if you don't know what I'm talking about, you can check my apartment empty apartment tour. I live in a one bedroom with a den, so there's like an extra room. And I'm gonna be decorating that space as like my beauty room slash office. So like this desk is the first piece of furniture that I have for that. And it's just taking me so long because I'm such an indecisive person and like it's like on level 1000 when I'm online shopping but like I'll open up one tab and be like okay let me find a white rug and I'm like okay but wait I'm gonna need a coffee table let me go look at coffee tables without even finding the rug I want because I can't even find one that I really like then I'll jump to coffee tables and I'm like oh but wait side table is also a thing let me go look at a side table and I'm like but wait I'm not even gonna remember all this let me write all of this down I need to probably put this somewhere all the items that I need and then I'll start shopping for something else and I'll remember, oh, I need something from Amazon. I need to go put in my car on Amazon. Oh, but I also want a couch for my den. Let me go look at couches without actually purchasing anything. And like the way that I'm speaking that fast, that's how fast my mind is going. So I just eventually like tire myself out shopping and be like, oh my gosh, I have to do this tomorrow. Yeah, so I'm gonna wrap this vlog up right here. I'm tired of talking. My head hurts. It's 523. Now that I clean like my side table, like I just keep the whatever book I'm reading right there third book in the series i don't know if i showed you guys in one of my vlogs but i'm i'm reading the bare knuckle bastards there's three books in this series and these are romance novels and these are actually really good i loved one and two and i'm on three and i was kind of skeptical because of one of the characters in the book i ended up not liking and now the book is focused on him his love story so we'll see if i'm able to love a villain's love story i don't think i've ever liked reading the bad guy's love story or done that before so but maybe he really isn't a bad guy i'm gonna probably figure it out but i really do think that i should honestly sleep and i should try and finish my liquid iv hopefully my next vlog i don't look a mess um but we'll see who knows most of the time i look a mess unless i'm 
filming like an actual haul or going out like y'all i'm in my house i think i'm tired so i'm gonna go ahead and go thank you guys so much for watching this video i love you guys so much make sure to follow me on my social media so you can keep up with me i love instagram you're gonna love me on instagram subscribe here so you can see more videos i promise we do way more fun stuff than this hope you guys enjoyed this vlog nonetheless i'm sorry it wasn't filled with so much stuff but yeah guys i'm gonna go to sleep and then i'll catch you guys in my next video bye guys Oh my god, my head hurts so bad. Ow. Okay. Honey people knows it. Pony more dope, pony more dope, pony more dope. Jerry, hello, kid. Hop in the club, tons with my lady.